Hello everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm from Team Gem. The problem we were trying to solve was we had to provide the latest COVID-19 data to the user. So we looked up REST API and we found free COVID data services. It is flexible by providing the latest data. Hello everyone, my name is Crystal and I represent Team Gem from SJK Chonghua Batu 4.5 miles. Today we will be presenting an app we call the COVID-19 Tracker app. First, here is the login page. For the login page, we use the Firebase database to store all the user information. If you would like to use the app, you have to register an account by clicking on Sign Up, which will lead you to another page to sign up an account. After you fill in the username and the password, click Submit, and it will show the notification that you have signed up successfully. Then, go back to login page, fill in your registered username and your registered password, click login and you're in. After you have logged in, you will see the case information page. This page is to show all the track data of COVID-19 cases. By selecting the countries, you have access to the latest update of COVID-19 cases in that particular country. The last updated time is provided so users are aware of the latest changes of the data. If you select a country which is not available or doesn't, does not have any cases, it will show a notification that there is an error and all the previous data from other countries will be cleared to avoid confusion. The information we provide for the COVID-19 cases are retrieved from a REST API service. It is free to use. We make the request by providing the country names based on the user selections, and the response is in JSON format. We use the response to display the data accordingly. If the response failed, it will pop up the error message as well. We also included the map of the country selected so that people will know where the country is, and they, co they can also zoom in or zoom out to see in detail. Once you are satisfied with the information, you may sign out by clicking on this button. And there you have it, the COVID-19 Tracker app. From this hackathon, I've learned how to use Firebase database. I've learned how to use API services and also practice teamwork with my brother.